And we've been celebrating right along with them all day long. Welcome to the show. I'm Mackenzie Roth filling in for Cassidy, and we're going to have a blast today. No doubt the Beavers have, you know, made the city come alive and electric, and we're going to have some fun ourselves tonight. It's going to get hot up in here. That's right. She likes to set things on fire, and she is here on the show tonight. Shireen from Flame Buoyant Productions joins us. I love the name, Flame Thank Buoyant, you girl. So much. Thank you. Uh, thanks for being here. So tell us a little bit about what you do. Yeah, so Flame Buoyant Productions. Productions is a fire and circus performance company. We specialize in customizing entertainment for all sizes of events and venues, um, but we also do a lot of instruction. So one of the things that I love to teach is poi spinning. Okay. Poi means ball on a string in the Maori language. So they're the ones that originated the art form that we have now developed to use equipment where we can light it on fire and spin it around. Now, when did your love of fire begin? Like at a young age, would you say? Um, young enough. Um, I've been doing it for quite some time. I saw fire dancing for the first time and I knew that I had to do that and I've been doing it ever since. So it's been about 19 years now. Wow, yeah. any mishaps? Have you ever singed an eyebrow? Uh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I've singed eyebrows, but so far no um, permanent scarring. So yeah, I Good. think that's a step in the right direction. And I, when I'm instructing, I definitely try to make safety the first priority always. I love that. And let's talk about your classes before you perform for us. Yeah, what classes absolutely. do you offer? Yeah, so um, this Monday I'm going to be teaching some of my advanced students actual fire skills. Okay. So uh, we go through a process, but I've been working with them for quite some time, so I know they have the basic moves down. Um, I am starting a new beginning level series on July 23rd. That's a Monday. And we use um, the Commotion Studio on Ooh. Northeast Prescott and 42nd. Okay, very yeah. cool. Okay, we were trying to do the fire performance inside. We couldn't pull that off. The right. bosses are like, uh -uh, no fire inside. <laughs> so you're going to do something else for us tonight. Yeah, so instead of using a ball on a string, I have some lights on chains instead. So you'll get the effect of the fire and the movement without all the danger. Okay, and she has warned me that I need to get out That's of the right. way. So, Shireen, do your thing. I might have questions as you performed. Can we put the lights down, please? That's right, we need the lights Turn down the so lights. you can see all the cool patterns. Oh, this is so cool. Just as good. How many routines do you have, Shireen? Oh, I well, I use lots of different kinds of props. So I also use flaming hula hoops and um, jump ropes and all kinds of other equipment like that. So I have multiple routines, both as solos and also with other dance partners. Flaming hula hoop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't believe you haven't been seriously injured by now. This is incredible. How do you begin when you think, hey, I want to you know, incorporate a new move into my routine? Uh, practice a lot without the fire first. <laughs> without the fire first. <laughs> and what's the trick to this, Shireen? Uh, which part? <laughs> Twirling and not burning yourself. Yeah, so um, I mean, it's definitely a good exercise in practice and paying attention. Um, but yeah, I definitely practice a lot before I ever present something on fire for my audiences. I see. What, have you gone to other fire performances that they, you just think, man, they're doing this all wrong? Um, I try not to. <laughs> <laughs> um, I definitely, there's a very high level of technique and skill in this area. And so, um, yeah, we prefer to keep it safe and keep fun. Keep it safe and fun. And one more time, where can everybody find you if they want to take your class? That's right. So Flame Buoyant Productions is at flamebuoyant.com. Can I hold one of these? You can. I don't know if I should do like the chain action. Maybe I'll just make it more. Well, hold on to the handle. OK. Maybe yeah, I'll just and give it, it a little like spin. That. There you go. Yeah, instant expert. Well done. I'm really happy this is an actual fire. Yeah. Shereen, thank you so much. You're I'm so welcome. Oh, I love those good. And come to my fun. class on the 23rd. I will be there for okay. sure. Well, tomorrow morning, perhaps you like brunch or in the mood for some delicious.